So, as you can see from the thumbnail, we've got a treat for you. It is you. a thumbnail as well, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, a yeah, yeah, yeah. Hopefully, yeah. yeah. You might notice a few little, Looks the few minor side. adjustments it's had if you come round this way. It's one colour. <laughs> She's looking grey, mate. <sighs> looking good. You'll notice straight away, we haven't got the badges on yet. I also need to get the, uh, the door decor. Obviously, if you've been with us from the off, you've seen the cosin, the paint and everything, you'll know that we use our mate Jones here. <laughs> and it always has to go back for a visit. There's some runs here. Slight run, yeah. With There's some runs. It's a 600 uh, quid job worth it, Dave. 500 quid? <laughs> <laughs> Had a bargain there, mate. Remember as well, Stokes, he gave me a little two-tone up here because we said it was dolphin grey and he put the other dolphin grey on. <laughs> so yeah, it's, it's looking good. It's looking good. He's done a good job there, hasn't he, on that, where we glued it together. Can't see any of your welding. I, I keep, like, we joint this here, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah, this was jointed here. And, <laughs> tell you what, you never know, would you? Mate, you never know. <laughs> Hey, you, you never ever know. <laughs> We've glued this together with another car. With, with Pritt stick. If you can remember, many episodes ago, we fitted the air filter into cooler and we did have a downpipe. But obviously, I haven't fitted the downpipe because of obviously you can't really drive it and stuff. It needs mapping. Yes, up. before you start messing around. So, we've got this back now. We have a trailer. Some of you clever lot have already get, guessed. That's gonna go on that, and tomorrow it's getting stage two properly. What horsepower are you expecting, mate? Apparently, you run about, you get about 450 out of it. I reckon, because it's yours, Dave, you'll get about 600. There you go then. Obviously, leaving it last minute is our favourite thing. But no, we're gonna back it in now, drop the subframe, and get it bolted on. That easy. So, I'm going to make this sound a lot easier than it probably is. We've got to drop the subframe. We've got to take it from here, because this is what we get rid of. We watched Chris Slicks' Mark 8 Golf R when they changed the, sub, uh, the downpipe, and they had to drop the subframe down, which we probably will have to, but I was just saying, he, here's his four-wheel drive. So he's got the prop. We've got that. the prop in the transfer box, so it might have been a bit tighter. So Before we go crazy and drop subframes, what we may not, yeah. probably we will have to drop. Let's get these bits off and then go from there. I'm not really happy with that. Uh, Look at that. that. It says it's not a D-cat, it's a race cat. Apparently, it's illegal to sell this to anybody who's going to use it on, on the, the road. road. That's why we're trailering it. But hold on, no, it isn't a D-cat though, is it? So we're fine, you can drive that it's on the road. It's a race cat. There's the cat there. They can <laughs> find it that small nowadays. <laughs> What's that big Wait, one? Where does this one, wow. One An hobo. One? Ah, was it a hobo? <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Oh. Hold on. Fucking <laughs> 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 tramp. Just farted in your face. So it's got a cat in it. So you won't like smell. <laughs> you won't smell it because it's got a cat in it. Fucking sniff. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No problem. Not my first rodeo, Lisa. <laughs> Lisa, check in the, check in the list. Oh. This is going to burn shit, isn't it? So, quickly, um, while John's knocking our wall down, uh, Stokes got a little hands in there, got all the little finicky little bolts out. He also got another one of these off, which was becoming a bit of a pain. Um, I'm now going to start taking the subframe because it looks like it's going to be the best op the basic option to get it out because she's a bit of a wide girl. Stage two is your idea. Not the day before well, you. What, what day do you want me to go, mate? 
The only day they, had, the only day they could fit me. Especially with this fucking electronic fucking gift. Rapid is your standard, man. You're giving it all the fuck out. I got a gear B for fucking yeah. D. I also said D, to take the cut off is an absolute nightmare. No, so. No, I didn't say no. It's so. all right, awesome. Yeah, yeah, I'm ready to go. <laughs> Have we gained any more in the looseness? Yeah. Uh, Right, so if you want to get the downpipe <laughs> out, you have to go over there, round there, back on. I've never ever. It's out there, isn't it? I can't even. I can't even talk right now. Didn't have to drop the subframe completely off there, did we? <laughs> watch you, out! Watch how easy this is. As you can see, because this has got all the cats in. This should hopefully not be an headache. That was an unconventional way I to do it. I don't know right. how we even managed it because we just managed us to. That was like, you know, operation or like a Rubik's Cube. No, if that was Stokes's. If that was Stokes's car, I'd have had that out in 10 minutes right there because you wouldn't have been like, no, you have to do yeah, it. Do you know who's no, Dave's car? Do I had to get it out in three hours. You, I got it out. Didn't. Yes, I did. Dave told us the way. Yeah, but I twisted it yeah, in the end. <laughs> well, that was easy. <laughs> we got there. We might have had a little bit of argument, and we didn't listen to uh, Big Dave. So it's getting huggy. That's what happens when he stays at the unit past six. He's probably hungry. He's probably not at all there. Have you started? Have you seen his belly? It could do him some good not eating. <laughs> Doing now? I'm taking his wheels off. Why? Because then I've got to put a bolt in. Yeah. Start your engine, please. Do you reckon that was a world record how fast we did that? Four hours and. I think it weren't going to happen at one point. Like, you were willing to. Until Dave, you were until about Dave to give turn up. left at the steering rack. A few huffs and puffs. We're ready. I'll load it up. Get it on the trailer. Yeah, ready for awesome in the morning. And I'd like to tell Lisa, now we are ready at 10 to 9 at night before the morning we're getting mapped. <laughs> Stokes, he's already been told off. Awesome, I've had a new car park and you are not allowed to unload your vehicle on it. Right, Stoke? <laughs> Parked up. Ready for the uh, awesome Rima. Apparently, you only get two free cups of coffee. So me and Dave have had one and you've got to pay $6.99 for one. It's, it's, it's lucky for this place. <laughs> for that new tarmac. <laughs> Have you seen this place? Oh, I've seen it, yeah. Look, them wind backs are nice. They do fine, aren't they? <laughs> they do, seriously. Oh, it is, yeah. It right. looks like his bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> so this is downstairs stores. Well, Can't cross down, on down, the down, stairs. Down, Bad luck. You, you yeah. knew the gaffer was coming. That's all you got all that in it. <laughs> <laughs> he's got his full hands full of it. He's panicked and grabbed anything. <laughs> <laughs> Massive, so, isn't it? Yeah, you got All I want to know is where the back door is and where the carbon is. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's no carbon stored on site, Dave. No All your polybush needs. Get that stone. There's some big brakes, they are. We have another dyno in here. Yeah. Okay. So, oh, is this your original dyno? This is our original yeah. dyno, yeah. As you can see, we groove these. Uh, we do the drilling. As well. All the bowels and yeah, yeah. yeah. So from the dark to the to the light. Yeah. <laughs> You're having a decap. <laughs> 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 
Yeah. We ain't got one of these, are you? No, yeah. Yeah, mate. It'd be I wet. This the roof leaks, <laughs> mate, and it'd be all. That's your all different oils and waters. Oh, oh my, you can literally put it out and, to and the air. car. Is it rare? Oh, man. Oil, water, everything's all fed over. Nice, isn't oh, it's it? nice and warm in here, isn't it? She said to put the heating on. Is this the grand unveiling? Oh, 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 oh. I hate that. Oh, you just say the word on the wall. Mate, that's awesome. <laughs> that is smart. Oh, isn't it? mate, look how nice that looks in there. This will be your headset. So you can speak directly to the guy in the car. Oh, my God. Mate, you, I'll tell you what, you've done a. Um, we brought it to the right place here. Watch it. Yeah. Up here is the dyno extraction room. And so then when you're running, when we're running your car, this is what will happen up here. <laughs> Remember when I had my M4 rolling road and it just had a hole in the back of yeah, it? Yeah. Yeah. Fan. Are we not seeing a pattern here, mate? Well, you do it properly. I do it properly, <laughs> and you do it on budget. I'm not saying that guy. You should. So, you've had the little grand tour of awesome GTI, or awesome. Um, Dave's car's strapped on the dyno at the minute, just doing a few little checks. But we just want to give a big thanks out to Mark uh, for showing us around. He's the, the owner. When did they start, Dave? 1988. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. 89. And this is what it's like now. And fair play to him. He's, he's, he was, he showed us round. He weren't like showing off. He just, no, no. He just wanted us to show how everything works and where it like. And we yeah. said to him, said, look, what you? It's like a hotel. Yeah, he's it's got, bang on in it. Yeah, and he, he's proud of it. He's yeah, he's got a bit. If he ain't mate, he's got his yeah. shoes. For for someone to have a company that long. Yeah. And still be here in this day and age. And, hey, and do you know what? Out. For me, he seems to value his employees like the yeah. old days. Yeah. He seems to be like an old school gaffer, yeah. you know, that would know everybody by name, yeah. thinking about, oh, hang on, what can I do to improve their work? This is where um, all, the, all the employees can get in the comments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, he, he's a nice guy, and like Dave said, He's, he's, he's done a lot for the employees here. Not, it's not just come to work, go to work, yeah, yeah, earn yeah. your money. They've, they've got a lot of stuff on side. Just, I, I'm just amazed that he's like took his top time out of his dad yeah, no, to we, show us around because we didn't. We expected to come, do a little bit of video, yeah. have a couple of free cups of coffee, have a laugh, or, and that was it. Or you get somewhere, uh, you go to place and they go, no, you can't film here. No, you can't film here. Yeah, I guess your money, off you go. But like I say, awesome. I've got their own YouTube channel for their bits, what they're yeah. doing. So go over to them. I, know, I mean, we give them a little follow, and that they've probably got loads more followers than us. Yeah. But, um, yeah. Just if you're interested in what they do, the amount of stuff they've got here, like kit wise. So well, he's been in the game for say thirty odd five years, years, yeah, five years or whatever. Um, they know what they're doing. Yeah. They know what they're doing. Well, I hope they know what they're doing. <laughs> and I feel a bit better now that Dave's paid the money, and we can. You know, we can Oh, right, yeah, Dave's paid the money again, has he? he even got DP. <laughs> no wonder it's so expensive to get your car back to it. Shock, stoked he's missing his answer. <laughs> we sat here pondering. He hasn't come in to say, I can't do it, your car's a nail yet. <laughs> or the, the sides fell off. Or the decat hasn't been fitted properly. <laughs> Stage two, I think, on the... Club Sport, because the Club Sport has different turbo, same as the Golf R. So yeah, so it's basically a two-wheel drive Golf, Golf R. R. Um, I think they reckon about 450. So it takes it from what? Three? 300. 300. To 450. That is a 150, 150 brake. That's, that is basically a... It's not even a one litre EcoBoost, because they're <laughs> 25. Don't even talk to me about one litre EcoBoost. So um, what do you reckon is going to come out at there? No, no, so me and Stokes now are going to have a bit of a, a bit of a guess. Yeah. Uh, Stokes, are you going to have to buy two sandwiches this no, week? No, no. So I reckon it's going to come out, I don't think it's going to be dead on. No. 450 no. brake, but I reckon it's going to be like 445. 445. Yeah. I'm going to go a bit, it's a cold day today. Oh. So. <laughs> and they're pushing that air in. Yeah, 4. 
51. Oh, you played it safe there, because you've gone that, over. Uh, should, Obviously, yeah. we've got to always do it in my favour. Because you've gone higher yeah. and closer. Yeah. That if it does go Hold like, it. no, no, if it does go to, say, I don't know, 449, yeah. on closest, because you've gone over. Yeah, but you think it's because of the cold day, it yeah. might, you know what? I like that thinking. What's on the line? I can of close. <laughs> As Jack hasn't turned up, yeah. right? Yeah, because yeah. he had other things to do. He buys us. Jack good. said it's only going to pull 220 horsepower, so I think <laughs> yeah, he's yeah. not going to buy the Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jack said. Jack said it's going to. He's going to come down. So <laughs> it's going to be mapped. It's here now. 290. <laughs> So that one's more or less standard, standard power. Yeah, 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 yeah. So Dave, he's just done a little run. Mark to explain. So this is the power. Curve. Little, yeah, the curve. And something's gone on here. Yeah, it's not happening. So one's torque and one's... Yeah. It, or whatever. He's he's just, obviously, I think he's just checking it over to see what it is. But he hasn't come in saying the car's going to blow up, so... Just send it. <laughs> Oh lads, it's just come in, he says that wobbly bit was the print stick falling off. <laughs> <laughs> that's, the, that's the side of the car, <laughs> that's, that's watch, Lisa, watch Lisa come in. Oh, my first rodeo. <laughs> my first rodeo, Lisa. Once watch that wind blower. You know, that'll blow the, the filler out of me, but I'm going to be a You already lost it, Tom. Might draw the runs. <laughs> Gone back wide, give us all. That little wobble will be because slope's curved that wheel. You dip, mate. I'm having no, this. I know what the wobble is, it's the bulge in the tyre. Oh, I'm just shaking. Oh, yeah. No oh. good. Oh, no good. No, no. Oh, look, it's having a wobble again. Oh, yeah. Tell him that. Uh, He's deleting it now. No one has said, oh, you know, teach him how to suck eggs or anything, but sport bottom. <laughs> <laughs> Dave's right, and the guy that's worked here for 30 years is wrong. <laughs> yeah. No, it all depends if his name's Dave. Oh. If the guy's name's Dave. Dave's always wrong. Two Dave's don't make a wrong. Oh, yeah. no. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's because Stokes put the Lambda sensors on one leg. Oh, look. No, no, I've got the Lambda <laughs> sensors the wrong, the wrong way around. Right, so we've got the graph back up. So that red line was the first run yeah and then the blue line so i don't it's know second run yeah i don't know if he's done anything yeah it yeah it seems to be in the same sort of yeah so i don't think he's done anything i, think, I don't know i'm confused here i don't know what's going on the, the bloke who's actually doing the map is just coming and explained so we're getting all paranoid now thinking you know it's going squiff and i'm only running and this is with the map on and all that but yeah. it's not so basically the car's stuck and we've added in the hardware of the Scorpion downpipe, uh, R-Line air filter, and the yeah. AirTech front mount. It's, it's getting around about that at the which, moment, I'm which is all right, that is, considering it's not been mapped yet. Yeah. That's all right, but don't you people out there start getting excited and think you haven't got to put your hand in your pocket to get like the thing, because if you run the car as it is without having it mapped and stuff, you will blow it up. Yeah. You've got this waviness. So that will probably be down to having the hardware on without the right map. Yeah. Hopefully, or the but Donny trips have nailed my car. Let, let's, go <laughs> old, let's go old school. So Dave, Dave's basically got an Irish servo at the minute and he's fitted a little bleed valve because he's put a few little mods on it. And what will happen is he turns it up too much and it goes bang. Yeah, so that's so what will happen. Then them guys now are going to map it all so it all runs yeah. how it should. We've got a couple of people in here now. Um, yeah, and we panic because it's like, oh. difficult, you know, when you yeah, 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 to stop Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're like, yeah, just get someone to come in here. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, on. yeah. They're like, uh, can, no, no, it's when you go to the doctors and they go, can you just go away back in the way? Are you in a call centre? Yeah. <laughs> What's he say, Dave? Come on. Is it a secret? Yeah. You say the he left... Ba he basically said, get rid of it quick. He's <laughs> <It's kind of laughs> it's, it's knocking on... Uh... Yeah, but ba basically he said uh, he wouldn't have wasted his money on it. <laughs> 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 no, no, no. He said he's not happy with the power. Yeah. So he's just going to have to do run a few checks to see if it's either the software or something up with the car that it's not meeting what it should do. Yeah, he's passing the headset round now. <laughs> we, we can all slag him off now if you want. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't he, Dave, laughing down his ear all over 10 minutes? Well, here we go, flamer kit. 
Yeah, 451? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Are you laughing at? That's me. No, that's what I'm laughing! Oh, she's got issues. <laughs> Did you fit that? Is that, is that the decap we fitted the night before, do you reckon we're messing with? No, 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 they're fitting with the uh, inlet pipe. Inlet pipe. See, Lisa knows her stuff, she knows Top. her coffees and the bits and bobs Selling on the car. Selling me dodgy parts, man. <laughs> That's the thing, getting brought everything from them. I brought everything from you. At the moment, the techs are under the bonnet because Stokesy has done something wrong, as per. Because it's not his car, so he's just no, thrown, he's can, thrown it together. I think it? they're messing with the turbo out the inlet elbow. I'll best lay off the Cokes now and the Dr. Peppers because they're going to give you a bill for rebuilding this car. No, they can't just rebuild my car and then give me a bill. Yeah, they can. They can say, look, what do you want to do? The, no, uh, he said, he went, do you want me to go ahead? I'll put my oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, yeah, go ahead. It's all right, it just comes off your truck, Bill. I think it's Tabby. His name. Correct me if I'm wrong. Anyway, I'm turning that TV down. No, that. that guy on the TV has just yeah. come in. Guy on the right. Yeah. So he's they've basically stripped a load of bits down off Dave's car because that spike you see, which is on the map up there, um, it's not that supposed to be nice and clean all yeah. the way up the red range. The, the, the turbo it has got a sensor for if it spins too fast or too much RPM. And the ECU seeing that and it's just pulling everything. So at the minute it's running 380 horsepower, which it should be 450-ish. But the ECU is just pulling it because it's, there's obviously, it thinks there's a problem with the turbo or it's seeing too much RPM. So they're just trying to just check the turbo, both sides. One side looks great. Um, and they said it could be a faulty sensor, which is giving a wrong reading of the turbo. So yeah, they're just... Fair place. Just brainstorming yeah, it they've got it to try and down. get us. And, um, to literally try and get us to where we need to be. Yeah, but like Dave said, he's took this out on the track day. He's had no engine management problems, um, no kind of running issues with it. So it seems a bit strange. He said it's either like, and it could be the air intake or exhaust blocked up yeah. or something like that. But that ain't the problem because we've got a decal on it and uh, we put the filter on it. So yeah, hopefully they can get to the bottom of it because if not um yeah we're gonna or dave needs a new turbo or something <laughs> yeah. but no they're cracking on with it mate normally at any other place you'd be like no it's broke mate take it out. yeah bro sort it out and bring it back yeah. so in usual car cartel fashion and anything that i own it's gonna stay here <laughs> basically we've had too many coffees and too many cans of coke out of the cupboard yeah so they need to uh, yeah eat one learn some money back for it uh, yeah but they've strips a lot down on it they've got this problem of the turbo is over spooling yeah it's working too hard and it's not allowing it to it, make the power yeah so so he's seen a problem yeah he's seen a problem so basically he said what they want to do is check all the hardware and all that sort of stuff so yeah what so we get that because they're saying it's an airflow problem so so basically this is an air leak i think or he's saying that he has checked the turbo and it's okay but he can't see the shaft and stuff so they just want to get it on the ramp yeah. check everything over and then they're going to let us know so we're going to leave it here for the, a couple of days aren't we well we're going to leave it with them aren't we? yeah so they're going so, to fix yeah. probably our problems what we've caused the lads have been great who have been sorting the car out and everything and they're going to get it back to me right because we don't want it we don't want it wrong do they we don't want to leave it's got to be right because yeah. the thing is if they send it away now wrong or issues i go to a track there blow it up i'm coming back to them and i'm precisely and they'll go dave you idiot you fit it yeah yeah wrong. yeah so yeah so yeah to hopefully. be continued yeah so as we just said it's uh i'm gonna leave the car here with awesome bit gutting because going home empty trailered you know it's a good job we come with <laughs> it's a good we job we we'd be, be formula lift wouldn't we but, um, but think, no, um, Dave, can you say something? I think we've left it with what? I was just specialists. Awesome. I was just about to say, I say a big thank you to uh, Mark for his hospitality today, and I'm more than confident we've left. We're leaving it with the right people. Yeah. To be I fair. mean, I'm not like trying to like. We're not. There, we're not. They're not paying us. Anything. Yeah, we're not clout chasing here or anything. But, but honestly, staff, he's been. A everybody's been absolutely yeah. great. If you've got, you got Audi, anything vague or anything like that, mate. 
And if you honestly, went, honestly, bring it here. And if you went and you got a BMW, go next yeah, door. Yeah, go next door. Honestly, I don't think now I'll bring my stuff to anywhere else than other than these. Um, but no, we're gonna uh, gonna leave it there now. Hopefully, you're gonna cop the next one. It's gonna uh, have all got a bit smoother. So, what do we normally say, though? Like, comment, follow, and subscribe. Yeah, and hit the bell icon. And we're gonna let this gentleman walk past. <laughs> <laughs>